All right, thank you, Alan. As we've been mentioning for a while now, News 5 and the Scripps Howard Fund are in the middle of our If You Give a Child a Book campaign, giving you the chance to make a difference in the lives of children here in Southern Colorado. And our Bree Groves out live this morning at Will Rogers Elementary School. And Bree, today is a very special day in the campaign. Ah, that's right, Brett. If you're just waking up, we've been talking about this all morning long, but this is our Blitz Day. So anything that you donate today, that is going to be matched by the Scripps Howard Foundation up to $175,000. That's a lot of money to be able to put books into the hands of students across southern Colorado. And we're at Will Rogers Elementary this morning. This is one of the schools directly benefiting from your donations today. So again, News 5 and the Scripps Howard Fund collecting money to donate books to five Title I schools in Southern Colorado. So if you'd like to donate, you can scan that QR code that you're seeing on the bottom of your screen right there. You can also go to koaa.com slash give a book and 100% of your donations. They are going to the kids here in Southern Colorado. And we all talk about it all the time, like reading is important, 15 to 20 minutes a night. As parents, we want to teach our kids to read, but Let's some, put some numbers with that so we can tell you just how vital it is. The statistics behind reading. In some low-income neighborhoods, did you know that there is only one book out there for every 300 children? Think about that. And a child who cannot read at grade level by third grade is four times less likely to graduate high school. Now, if that same child lives in poverty, they are 13 times less likely to graduate. So a small donation as we know, can make a huge difference for these kids. There is one organization that we have partnered with each and every year who has been just amazing when it comes to this, and that is AFSIA. This is an, a local organization that helps students with academics in so many different facets. So AFSIA, they give scholarships to students in our community, donating once again to our book campaign this year. And we know that this group donated a large portion last year, actually $45,000 this year. That number is even higher. They are donating $65,000. And FCA's donation will provide 1,500 local students 10 books each this year that they get to take home. They get to build their own little library at home with these. The cost comes out to just a few dollars per book. And Russell Fellers with the organization says seeing the kids' faces when they pick out their books is just so heartwarming. To pick their books out, they're incredibly excited, and uh, they just can't decide what book they want. Uh, it's only five, and they, they're just running around, and they got so many books they want to read. And you know now that uh, you know this is something that's important, right? And you can see it in their eyes. And it's important for so many different reasons. Go to koaa.com slash give a book. You can read about it, why, why this is so vital for kids and about how you can donate, even if it's just a few bucks. And then coming up on News 5 today, we're actually talking with the preschool teacher here at Will Rogers Elementary about why he sees such a change when reading to kids in his class. Stay with us.